What is going on, everybody? Thank you for tuning in to another edition of On the Road to Victory. It is Sunday afternoon, a beautiful day out there. Hope you're all enjoying it, but this is not a live video. Wanted to record this one quick, get it out to you as soon as I possibly can, but we've got some coaching news here. We've talked about, you know, Sean Desai is going to continue adding to his staff. We will continue to stay on top of it. So right here, right now, we're going to talk about the latest addition to the defensive staff. Mike D'Angelo, who has the same name as my cousin, so shout out to you, Mike. But uh, defensive quality control coach brought in here, and uh, let's take a look at this young man's resume here. So he graduated, and right off the bat, he went in 2006 to become a assistant quarterback and special teams coach for Concord. Then right after that, he went to Washington and Jefferson, where he was an assistant to the defense, special teams, quarterback, and wide receivers throughout 2007 and 2013. Then you see he went on to become a defensive graduate assistant. And then I believe in 2015, he was moved to an analyst, but he was with Rich Rodriguez in Arizona from 13 to 18. And then Old Miss and Illinois then after that as a quarterback analyst. And then you see a tight ends and wide receivers coach for Louisiana Monroe. And then, of course, he just came from Jacksonville State as the tight ends and slot wide receivers coach. So he's got defense and offense you know, on his resume there, and obviously these guys, they're in football, they know everything, but he knows both sides of the ball, studies the quarterback a lot, and I think he's going to really help out Sean Desai's staff. So let's take a look at that staff now, what we know so far. So Desai, you know, hasn't let go of Rocker, Washburn, or any of the other guys, DK McDonald or Scudder, but he brought in DJ Elliott as his linebackers coach. Tabor Johnson is apparently being brought in as some form of a secondary coach. You have Ron L. Williams, who was brought in as a nickel cornerbacks coach. And then uh, I mentioned DK is still here as that assistant. Maybe he gets moved into a different role. But now Mike D'Angelo there at the bottom as the defensive quality control coach. So filling out that staff, and I'm sure he could add another, you know, quality control guy or assistant and, a lot of things could go into the you know this staff, but got most of the positional coaches down. So love to see it. And uh, here's the offensive staff. In case you missed it, a couple guys got some promotions, but uh, other than that, you know Brian Johnson, obviously now the offensive coordinator, um, looking like a lot of the same offense. But I think going to see some nice uptuning there. So excited about this offense. Excited about the defense and. Excited to see what Mike D'Angelo can do as that defensive quality control, how he can help Sean Desai. Very excited to see this defense, and we'll be breaking that defense down throughout this offseason. But if you have any questions, any comments, maybe you know more about Mike D'Angelo, want to give your opinion on him, whatever it may be, I would love to hear your thoughts. Hope you're all having yourselves a great weekend. Hope you're enjoying that draft series. I will be getting into edge rusher tonight. Uh, it's going to be a little bit later. If not, I'll have to do it tomorrow, but I'm going to try to get tonight. So turn those notifications on, but I'd love to hear your thoughts on this, ladies and gentlemen. That's all I've got for you. If you got anything from this, do me a favor and hit that like button. You can always subscribe, as I mentioned, but thank you for tuning in. Have yourselves a beautiful rest of your Sunday. And until next time, I am Jimmy Smith, and this is On the Road to Victory. You stay safe out there, and as always, go birds! <laughs>